Hi, it's Marie here from Sweden. Welcome to my channel, aka Planner Mother of Three. And if you would like to connect with me on Instagram, my name is Planner underscore Mother of Three. I'll put the address here. I have shaken this one up a little bit. Uh, this is my weekly Hobonichi of 2020, and I have haven't really, you know, find the best way of using it. I've tried out it in different ways. I'll show you a little bit of how it looked before. Um, I used the index, the yearly page for some kind of tracking. Um, and I haven't continued that. I did that for not, not even a month. Uh, then I find, found out that I didn't really like the planner as it was. Uh, I put these stickers that come from Miss Fancy Plants, I think her name is. Um, and I put, you know, uh, these, I, I, what I did here was that I logged from my Apple Watch some, you know, things like how many calories I burned if I was training and so forth. And uh, also what, what kind of training I did. I did a lot of seven minutes that month. And uh, every time when I forgot to put on my watch, I put the sticker on the, with the watch here. So that one went quite well as this one. This one, I mean, the aim was to, to have not that many Apple Watch stickers because that meant that I would, you know, have it on my wrist instead. So here I could, you know, see how my, how many calories I burnt, and uh, and I could write some things about how I felt about the month. And then I did that in April, and then I stopped, and then I haven't used it at all. I'll show you how I use it now. And if we then go to the weeks, I haven't been using the weeks at all, as you can see in the beginning. Here I started to do some lettering um, and basement that was the word that I was training on I don't know really why anyway and then nothing happened and then I started to track the food that I was eating how I was feeling you know physically and mentally and I did that for a couple of weeks and then I stopped again um, then I just had, because here we are in the in this in the epic of the COVID, the center of the COVID period, so we didn't have that much work. So here I just wrote a word of a day that was, you know, really important. So that I did for a couple of weeks. Then I stopped with that, and then I started to journal in it. So, and that was kind of nice, sitting down and finding quotes. Happiness is an inside job, no pressure, no diamonds. Be loyal to your future, not to your past. There's bravery in being soft. Don't be the same, be better. When nothing goes right, go left. Strive for progress, not perfection. Hope, hold on, pain ends. That's a really nice one. Yeah, and so forth. And then I started to write about my personality type regarding Jung. And I am licensed in that test. And I am an ENFP. So here I write, you know, the characteristic, characteristic about that kind of personality. And here is a mental thing in Swedish says kanske, kanske inte, and that means perhaps or perhaps not. And that's something that you can ask yourself when your mind is, you know, going in all kind of directions and are starting to think about things that are in the mind true. And you can answer that by, yeah, maybe it's true and or maybe it's not true. That's a really effective way of stopping going in circles. And here is the the ENFP things, and then I stop with that. So
So then I saw a um, video from Penguins Creative and she is actually the one that inspired me the first time to do this, this uh, tracking where you log your your food on the one side and then how you are feeling on the other side and um, so I decided this week to start that again uh, and this time I will log the food here what I actually eat we have a meal plan of what we are going to eat but here is what I'm actually going to eat or where I, what I have actually eaten and the weather logging and that's from a washi that I have and I haven't used so I decided to start using it because I have a lot of it and whenever I you know to find a sun you have to start getting the the tape out to find a new sun and then you will pass maybe a cloud or, or a, an umbrella like look here so here comes the sun do 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 here comes the sun, do 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 do. It's all right, do 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 do. do. Well, whatever. Um, so let's say I was going to use the um, umbrella. Then I tear off these, and then I go for the umbrella. And then I have two stick, two small symbols that I want want to use later on. Not today, but for another day. So what I've done is that I put it here. So I put them here, and then I can go straight to this one and put the ones that I need for the day. So, yeah. And uh, so here's the food that I've been eating. Here's the weather here in Stockholm. Today we have a wonderful Sunday with a lot of sun and a blue sky. And here I track my body and as I've been sick, uh, so I have tracked my temperature. This morning I didn't take it, I forgot but I woke up with a really sore throat, so I am in one way worse today again. I, f I was feeling better uh, Friday and then I'm now I'm back with my sore throat. Uh, I actually, wait. I actually woke up with my sore throat this morning. I couldn't, you know, keep sleeping, so. annoying but uh, it's just it's the way it is and here is the mental and the soul section and right now I'm feeling quite well so I am more stressed about what what am I stressed about is, am I stressed yeah I think I'm stressed or annoyed maybe um, frustrated about me not being able to be focused uh, about my health I don't have any health issues more or less I mean I'm not I'm 55 so I can't I can't uh, do thing some some things um, because of my age and my body but um, uh, but I really would like to take better care of myself because I really would like to get old and healthy so that's a frustration more than a, a uh, a state of you know physical disability right now anyway so this is how I'm gonna use do it for next week um, I am thinking of doing exactly the same thing but I would like to put another color here I thought I was going to go for the gray so I use the the gray the the upper part of the page and then I use this line and I just fill it in so you just get a shade of it like that uh, I don't think that I want to put a line here or do I yeah let's do that for this week it's not straight straight but it's a line and on that side I will do put the, the weather and here I will write about the food and um, I can't really see the squares but 
they are there. So it's interesting. Anyway, uh, let's use the fountain pen this time. It's a Lamy uh, or Lamy, L-A-M-Y, and I just put a new ink to it. So here is breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So I'll write that, and I'll talk to you after that. So this has to dry before I close the book and so what I'm going to do here is that I will write all, all the things that I eat during the week and I have space to write if I take any snacks in between the meals and here will be uh, the body I write like this, this time, body, and here will be the soul. So, body and soul. Yeah, I think that will be enough for this spread. Uh, this is not, you know, something that I decorate, it's just, you know, a, a quick, quick fix for the next week. And what I do here is I'll I do it like this. I, I don't know if I, I can't really put it down because then it will smear. So here I log different um, parts of my life. I log the water intake uh, if I am all happy with that. And as you can see, I am not. So I haven't put because I drink always to. I drink a lot of coffee, but I forget the water. The um, and I use the stencil from Hobonichi that is here the yellow one or yeah the yellow one uh, and I use the walk uh, walk symbol for when and I use it for two two different ways if it's filled in black that means that I've been sweating and if it's not it means that I've been out walking Sometimes I do walks and it can be for an hour and sometimes I do a sweaty walk and that can also be for an hour or can be for 15 minutes. So every time I sweat and every time I do the walk and I did that three times last week and, and sweat means not only walking, it can be like CrossFit that I did on Monday and then I had a really bad sore so I went out try to walk it off but it just got worse so then these days I couldn't even move I was working out working with a big group but I couldn't walk in the stairs for instance it was it was painful and the car I use for explore because I know that I when we do that I really feel uh, happy and that could also be for these two days when I went out out from the house and was exploring, you know, for work. So I write that car symbol for these two days there. Uh, the yellow house means that I work at home. And this one means that I work outside, like for this. Sorry. Uh, and then you have these the fork and the knife and if it's filled it means that I have been in under full control during the day and if it's partially uh, uh, what do you say um, painted then it's half and half and when it's not it means that it, it there's there was no control and yesterday we had no control we had a control but we made really bad choices and um, Today I've written these, I haven't filled it in, so we'll see how this day will go, but uh, my intentions are to good, make really good uh, uh, good choices. Um, alcohol, um, I had that Thursday and Friday, um, not full, there I was nearly a full glass, like, you know, not that much, but that means 
<clears throat> that <clears throat> that means that I felt really happy and I wanted to have some some wine and here I felt like no I want to be restricted I want a glass but not more than that so that it's both that I drink alcohol but also how the feeling was you know around it and um, the heart with that is pink that means that I make good choices and the heart with the green means that me and my husband has, has you know has a nice time together um, it we are very happy together and um, yeah so but this is when it's extra you know it's when you're level up um, yeah so here is more of you know coloring and putting all the symbols on the right day and so forth but here is just to write so and what I also did and I'm very happy for that uh, these two you know strings are really I don't like them in the weeks because they are so thin and you can't really use them for anything they are so light that they won't stay on the page so what I did was that I deconstructed uh, jewelry that I had or it's not a worth no money at all but I like these and I tied them to the strings and I really find them very cute so now it's heavy and now it stays on place so that's kind of cute I think so thank you so much for watching um, and uh, I, I am really happy to make this new you know connection with my weekly and because uh, I have ordered a couple of them and um, so yeah stay tuned and I'll show you more I hopefully I will get some new Hobonichi things this week and I'm happy to be able to show you them for you okay take care and um, have a nice day bye bye <laughs>